you know who who drove my shit crazy, bro? Who? <laughs> Cause like, her, um, Alex. Alex. Oh, that's a uh, trippy res. Bro, I never realized how fucking beautiful that woman is, bro. <laughs> She's so goddamn gorgeous. <laughs> She's like a mix of like goth and hood. It's 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 a cool combo. Me personally, we're talking about trippy res ladies, man. Coyle Ray got that's the one. Oh, he was with her too. Yeah, he was with Coyle Ray. That's the only reason I knew who Coyle Ray was at first. Like. That trippy rare relationship. I think that's when most people found out about her. I mean, she's like a, a whole famous person, though. She's like a whole now celebrity. Now she's a whole celebrity. But when she first came out, she was just Trippy Red's girl. First song I ever heard from her was a feature on Trippy Red's song. And that was before her any of her songs. Bro, I know that Alex is my dream girl. Because I had sworn off I'm not going to buy no girls only fans, right, ever. And I had just been done doing my, being my shit. <laughs> And I, I just ran across her page randomly and then I saw her. I was like, oh shit. Bro, like when when you just like go nut right after you just nutted and it hurts and shit, <laughs> that's how you know that's your dream one. <laughs> that's your dream one. Nah, I put you, bro. And I spent I and I ha- and I paid for her OnlyFans and I was like, fuck. Nah, what well, I'm curious just, though, go go back to what you're saying. You're saying that you don't feel like it if you feel like it's a perception thing. Like if you believe that it affects you negatively then it's gonna affect you negatively and if you believe it doesn't affect you then it won't affect you yeah because one day um remember that day that we, we were robbed yeah and the day before um i had um i had i had beat it to the better danger <laughs> and then i was like that's why i remember he said like oh you feel like you can obtain her because i had met her in like real life and i could tell that she was like like attracted to me so i was like okay yeah she's like obtainable mm-hmm. and it's so funny because after i noticed her I thought that and I was and it gave me so much energy and I was like usually like when you nut when you masturbate you get depleted yeah but that you get you like charged up bro, I, f- I forget where I'm recording this <laughs> I forget where I'm recording this yeah nah, uh, like I'm gonna clip this and put it on TikTok <laughs> and people that follow me like yo Nick I saw you yo. talking about fucking masturbating <laughs> <laughs> nah but it's funny because I believe I I, I don't know 100% like when you talk about the physical stats and shit like that, but I will say there's a huge placebo effect. And the reason why I participate in, and you know, holding my, my sexual energy no and shit, no fab and all that is because not necessarily because I believe that the actual semen is charging me up and, it's done, and it has all this energy, which it is somewhat true. Yeah, I was going to say that, it is though. <laughs> yeah, it is. It, you need that energy to go up to your, go up your spine and that's how you activate your, your chakra so you can get, uh, activate your kundalini and do all that cool stuff. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know much about it. I'm not gonna get into it and act like I'm some fucking. Yeah, I don't mean to interrupt you, bro. But the other day, I'm gonna say it real quick and you can go. No, you're see what you're saying. 